quick review of everything that we covered earlier here. Starting with, again, from the side. So initially, as you feel that knee starting to go in, I check it by sitting on my hip. Now I'm quickly gonna move to the next one because I know that he's gonna start pulling here, pushing in that direction. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my hand and I'm gonna swing it over so I can go to this north, this angled position here. From here, he ends up in a nice position here where I can start taking, I chop, and start pulling in sideways here and I start climbing up. Now from here, I can switch this to the Kimura. I can also sit back into the arm bar. Then we went into secondary move here where I check the hip, but instead of going to that angled, I take my top leg and I go completely over here, okay? Now I make sure that my heel starts pulling on his neck. Should get a reaction of him wanting to push this arm out of the way. My, my elbow goes behind. Now I go back to my knees and I get a good grip here. Palm to palm, I just go forward and I start squeezing. I have another tap there. This is not working. He's still offering me a lot of pressure. Pay attention to what I do with my feet here. I turn so that I can get this arm of his isolated. So I turn this way here. And now all I'm going to do is I'm gonna take my left foot and I'm gonna go over his face here. As I do that, back of my arm is trapping. And now from here, I just move my hips forward. And you get a tap from there. Here, boom, throw the leg fights it went here doesn't work I move up trapping both his arms I, sh I wiggle myself up but I don't release anything now I throw this leg over I walk it down and with the back of my arm I go forward till you get a tap from there any questions one three one two